Hello, this is Lee Natero. Let's take a look at how the TI-89 can help us to choose a simple random sample. To do this, we'll go to Catalog, choose F3 Flash Apps, and you need to scroll down to find the command uh, random integer. Hit Enter. Um, the lowest number in our list of students would be numbered 1, and the number of students in this particular school, the total number of students is 1,750. So we want to generate random integers between 1 and 1,750 inclusive of those values. So the first student that would be selected would be student number 230, and then 912, and 1,738, and so on. And if we came up with any numbers that repeated in our list, obviously we can't choose to ask a student a question more than once. We only want to use each student once in our simple random sample. So I'd have to run the command again until I had 10 distinct numbers. However, sometimes students end up generating the same list of random numbers, and that's because their calculators still have the seed that was placed in them at the factory. We need to sometimes seed the calculator. To do this, we're going to go to Catalog, choose F2, and then we would scroll down to this command called random seed. And what you want to do here is type in some number that's probably unique to you, or at least unique to you as a student in that classroom. You might want to type in your birth date or your phone number. And then it says done. And as long as your random seed is not the same as your neighbor's random seed, you will end up with different lists of random numbers.